What are the treatment options for an extremely high PSA level? Hello and welcome to our informative video about prostate-specific antigen, commonly known as PSA. This protein is produced by both normal and malignant cells of the prostate gland. In today's discussion, we'll focus on the treatment options for extremely high PSA levels, which may be a cause for concern. Remember, understanding PSA levels and how they affect your health is crucial, but always consult with a medical professional for personalized advice. What does a high PSA level mean? A high PSA level can be indicative of different conditions including prostate cancer, but it's not a standalone diagnostic tool. A high PSA level might also point to benign prostatic hyperplasia, BPH, prostatitis, or even be a result of recent procedures or activities that stimulate the prostate. It's important to note that high PSA levels don't immediately mean you have prostate cancer. A further diagnostic process is required to understand the cause. What are the diagnostic options? When you have a high PSA level, your healthcare provider will likely recommend additional diagnostic procedures to ascertain the cause. 1. Digital Rectal Exam DRE. This is a physical exam where the doctor checks for any abnormalities in the prostate gland. 2. Prostate Biopsy a sample of prostate tissue is taken and examined under a microscope to look for cancerous cells. 3. Imaging tests. MRI or a specialized test called multiparametric MRI, MPMRI, can be used to get a more detailed look at the prostate gland. These tests help to either confirm or rule out the presence of prostate cancer. What are the treatment options? Treatment options vary depending on the cause of the high PSA level. Here are some potential treatments. 1. Watchful waiting or active surveillance. If the prostate cancer is not causing any symptoms or problems, the doctor may decide to closely monitor the patient without starting treatment immediately. 2. Radiation therapy. This uses high-energy rays or particles to kill cancer cells. 3. Prostate surgery. The prostate gland is removed during a procedure known as a prostatectomy. 4. Hormone therapy. This type of treatment aims to lower testosterone levels which helps to stop cancer cells from growing. 5. Chemotherapy. This involves the use of drugs to kill rapidly growing cells, including cancer cells. Choosing the right treatment depends on multiple factors including age, overall health, and the stage of the prostate cancer, if present. It's always important to discuss with your healthcare provider to find the best suitable option. So, that wraps up our discussion on high PSA levels and the associated treatment options. Remember, a high PSA level is a signal that something may be amiss, but it doesn't automatically mean you have cancer. Diagnostic processes and consultation with healthcare professionals are essential in understanding the situation and choosing the appropriate treatment. We hope this video has been helpful. Stay informed and take care of your health.